Good afternoon and welcome to Nikos RPG. I'm Jonathan Alvin and I want to thank you for joining me on this journey. We are on part two of a six part set that will give you the ability to create a persona for the Nikos RPG under the Dark Shards system book. Alrighty, so as we were talking about step two, step two is the choice of race and in the terms of Gameplay race fundamentally means species there. As you notice, I've got the names listed here. We have Eldrin, Fairfolk, Grundim, Mannequin, Mortals, Rook, and Technomaton. These represent the principal species of the planet, and they do have characteristic definitions. So let's put those up, shall we? So the Eldrin are children of the forests, and that means either in the Everdark or in the Undersky, that is the normal world realm, as we would say. We have the Fair Folk, which are children of the meadows. We have the Grundim, who are children of the mountains. The Mannequin, which are children of the moors. Mortals, that are children of the plains. The Rook that are children of the Barons, and we have Technomaton who are considered the children of men since they were constructed by them. Well, with these terms, you just get a general feeling, so you would pick generally first. You would choose which of these generally you would like to be, and then we can look at the specifics. So for the sake of that, we're going to go ahead and indicate that we've made that choice. But once you've made that choice, each one of these species has subspecies. So let's adapt for that. Alrighty. So among the Eldrin, you have the Freilaren, Undrin, and Nandarin, Primus, and Treloran. Among the Fair Folk, you have Gnomes, Tinks, and Quumples. Under the Grundim, you have the Grim. Grim the Grundim have both Grun and Grund. Amid the Mannequins, you have Midge and Peck. Among mortals, you have Humankind. Then you have Bothrakine, six types, and Morrowind, eleven types. The Rook constitute the Aruk and the Maruk. And the three types of technomaton are Destrian, Dredge, and Misfit. Now, these are all available for description on, in, in the Dark Shards system book. And that is available at nikosrpg.com. If you go to the shopping mechanism, the store there, you'll find the book available as a PDF. Or you can purchase the paper-bound, glossy-covered, version at lulu.com you simply just have to look up nikos when you get there nycos like it's got on the list. all right so picking the species and the subspecies sets you up for uh, additional benefits called marks and these are the specific Genetic identifications, if you will, of the various species, and every one of them has between six, uh, seven and nine of them, and each uh, character, or each persona, will only have at most six of them as standoff features. Um, you can choose to take less than all of them, but you cannot take more than six. All right. That will take care of the description of the race and the subrace for now. We will continue in the next part when we talk about step three. All right, so that will be it, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks again for watching.